Remember how I said one of the first challenges of creating Game 34 was figuring out how to fit the rich culture of Prague into a playable location? Well, the more we researched the city, the more we discovered how exactly we wanted to shape Nancy's latest mystery. Many of the true legends and lore of Prague even made their way into our character's world. We're still looking for more ways to really bring out the creepy feel of the area. What are some of the scarier things you've discovered? While not every local tale made its way into our game, our team became fascinated by all of the stories we heard. How was your walking tour today? Did you learn anything not in your guidebooks? I definitely learned some local secrets. One was so interesting, I had to go back and film. Ooh, totally message in a Haunted Mansion vibes. Prague, city of kings, city of ghosts. Now don't get scared, but right now I'm walking across the Haunted Charles Bridge. Legend goes that on June 21st, 1621, 27 noblemen were executed. And every summer solstice, 12 of them come back, looking for their heads. Now, you know me, and you know I love trivia. So it is time for a super secret indie trivia on the Charles Bridge. Question, what is under the Charles Bridge? And no, I don't mean water. Give up? It's hollow. So they don't store anything under there. We don't really know what's under there, but there are about four or five secret trap doors along Charles Bridge. And if you are one of the lucky ones to have a key, and no, I don't mean one of the seven, you can actually go under the Charles Bridge and see what's going on down there. This is such a super secret secret that even Google doesn't know about it. If you Google it, you might find one or two articles referencing it, but you can only find one photo that someone leaked. How are you? We're hard at work on game testing. I need a brain break. Have you seen anything that reminds you of previous Nancy Drew games? Actually, yes. This morning, I toured St. Vitus Cathedral and found some stained glass by Alphonse Mucha. In the pre-development stage of this game, and especially during the preparation for this trip, I tried to learn everything I could about Prague. Because we know but it, we with know the culture learned, so rich, uh, I was right never hand, going to be an expert uh, with learned, every subject. Did you get to learn more on the history of ancient Bohemian lands? Prague was often at the center of those lands where some rulers and emperors kept their main residence. We're still researching the one for our game who had a very specialized royal court. Yeah, he had a collection of people, that's for sure. Astronomers, alchemists, mathematicians, gem carvers, even magicians. We found the time period to be filled with Bohemian royals, legends, and lore. All our research is really filling up our game's exhibit hall. Thanks for sending, Indy. Not to be cheesy, but we're kind of like our own court.